As the state struggles with trying to figure out where to house juvenile offenders, officials are moving forward with plans to open a new secure juvenile facility in Vermont. Earlier this year, the Department of Children and Families reported that they were looking to build a new facility in either South Burlington or in Virgins. That's after the closure of the state's only juvenile facility, the Woodside Rehab Center in Colchester. The, the Department of Children and Families says that they expect to sign an agreement with the winner pr winning proposal in the coming days, but the state representative uh, Diane Lanfer from Virgins tells us that state officials are leaning toward building that facility on the state owned property near Comfort Hill Street and McDonough Drive in Virgins. That property stretches more than 400 acres and right now the main fixture on the property is the federally owned Northlands Job Corporation. The property is also the site of the former Weeks School Juvenile Facility, which was first, first built in the 1800s to house youth offenders. That facility was also involved in the eugenics movement. It closed in 1979. Virgin's Mayor Chris Bearer tells us that if this agreement is reached to open that facility in Virgin's, he's going to seek out feedback from the community about it. He says that facility could be a win-win if everybody is included properly in this process.